I hear so many times from agents, it's the wrong number. This data is no good. Vulcan 7 is no good. Mojo is no good. Land Voice is no good. Red X is no good. It's all bad data. Hey guys, the reality is the game is when you're prospecting, you're going to get a lot of bad numbers. This script is the solution to that and how you can turn a wrong number into potentially a client. My name is AJ Mida and my passion is helping real estate agents create financial freedom. Let's get into it. Here's the script guys. If it's the wrong number, there's still an opportunity for business. So they're like, hey, wrong number, no idea what you're talking about. I sold that house five years ago. That's my brother's house. That's my dad's house. Whatever the answer is, you say, hey, oh my gosh, I'm so sorry about that. My name is AJ. I'm a local real estate agent. And since I have you on the phone, I have to ask, do you know anyone looking to buy or sell a house? And kind of say it laughing, lighthearted. And they're probably going to say no even if they know somebody, because there's no relationship and they're not going to say, oh yeah, my, my neighbor wants to sell their house. You know, they're not going to just refer you that easy. So they're usually going to say no. And this is where it really opens up the conversation because they can speak on their own behalf. So you keep it very, I guess, light by saying, do you know of anyone else looking to buy or sell? And when they say no, then you go into, okay, great. When do you plan on moving? Or, okay, great. Do you have any plans to sell in the next couple of years? Or, okay, great. Just out of curiosity, how long have you lived in your home? I would probably just stick with the script, <laughs> like it's written, and say, hey, okay, great. When you plan on moving, or if it feels more comfortable, say, okay, great. Just out of curiosity, do you have any plans to sell within the next two years? Again, this is going to start building your nurture farm. I've had people in the past that say, you know, actually, I was just thinking about selling and booked an appointment that way. So you can go on to... Okay, great. Are you local here in the Charlotte area? Because sometimes you're just getting out of state numbers at this point. People that moved out of the area, people that never lived in the area. You know, the reality is, is when you're calling thousands of people over time using something like Red X, you're going to get people all, all over the country, out of the city, out of the state, usually not out of the country. But uh, so you say, are you local here in Charlotte? They say, yeah. Okay, great. You know, just out of curiosity, who do you have keeping you up to date with today's local market? And the answer is probably no one. So you can say, okay, great. I'd like to be your agent. I can add you to our monthly newsletter and keep you up to date on today's local market. Would that be okay? Okay, great. What's your best email? It's really that simple, guys. All we're trying to do is to get into conversation with potential sellers. Sometimes with this script, you'll get people who are looking to buy investment properties. So you can even ask if you're like, hey, when you plan on moving, they're like, never. Okay, totally. That's awesome. Glad you found your forever home. I also work with a lot of real estate investors. Have you ever thought about investing in real estate? What you're doing is creating more conversations for you to get into a relationship with people that are going to be doing some business. So that's what it is right there. That's the wrong number script. Hope it was helpful. If it was, subscribe to the channel. Really appreciate it. See ya.